21st Century Skills, the Young Entrepreneur Program, and Something Personal, this week on Tuesdays with Schwartz. Live from the Leap Academy Studios, welcome back to the Tuesdays with Schwartz podcast, where every Tuesday I take a look at one 21st century skill behind the scenes of the Young Entrepreneur Program and share something personal. If you want to watch the entire podcast without interruption, simply subscribe to my free newsletter. The link is in the description. In honor of Black History Month, I'm going to dedicate the first 21st century skill to talking about black history. So let's see what the 21st century wheel has to say. And it looks like leadership will be the 21st century skill of the week. For those of you who are following me on social media, my account name is at the school doc, then you already know that Leaf Academy just released the most comprehensive 21st century course on black history in K-12 education today. And since the 21st century skill of the week is leadership, let me tell you about what students will learn on day one of this groundbreaking black history course. Day one's learning objectives is to teach students about the visionary leadership of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. And the reason why this is day one of this course is because all movements need a leader. And leaders are people who create new visions for the future. For example, America was founded on a vision that all men were created equal. So what was Dr. King's vision for America? And to learn his vision, we need to look deeper at his speech on August 28th, 1963. That's the day Dr. King stood in front of the reflecting pool in Washington, D.C. and told America, I have a dream. But it was more than just a dream. It was a vision for the future of America. And in that vision, Dr. King hoped that one day everyone could live in peace regardless of what they look like or where they were born. As Dr. King said, looking out onto the crowd of hundreds of thousands of people, I have a dream that my four children will one day live in a nation where they will not be judged by the color of their skin, but by the content of their character. I have a dream today. Unfortunately, our school system doesn't teach the whole speech. And so children never learn the rest of Dr. King's vision which is why I developed the most comprehensive course for Black History Month called The 28 Days of Black History. You can guess from the title that this isn't one day of black history, but 28 straight days that go from Dr. King's vision all the way to day 28, where students get to discuss where do we go from here in 2024. No other course in K-12 system covers everything to do with black history and no other course was designed to be taught by two teachers at the same time and because i know that might sound confusing to you here's one example every american went to school that's what we all have in common not only did we all go to school but we all took classes taught by one teacher in one subject that means we all took english math science and social studies classes the problem is That according to academic research experts, 21st century learners need cross-curricular learning opportunities. But what does that really mean? So here's the answer. It means that we need to stop teaching classes the same way. The 28 Days of Black History is the first designed cross-curricular course in K-12 history. And that means this course's curriculum map was designed for both middle and high school English and social studies teachers. That's right. This course can be taught by both English and social studies departments together or separately. Right now, students have to take old and boring classes that were written before the telephone was even invented. The 28 Days of Black History is a modern, cutting-edge course that was designed with 21st century learners in mind. Therefore, when students take the 28 Days of Black History, not only are they learning the most comprehensive 28-day unit of black history, but they are also getting two different perspectives on that history. One perspective is from the social studies teacher who will focus on the history of what happened to black Americans from the 1600s through modern society. And then the second perspective is from the English teacher who will focus on the readings, speeches, and texts of black history. 
Together, these two teachers will engage students better than any single class in your school, which means no more attention deficit issues, no more falling asleep in class, and no more student boredom. And guess what? Also, no more student behavioral issues. When you meet the needs of 21st century learners, you no longer have the problems we see in our schools. Leaf Academy is offering this groundbreaking 21st century curriculum app for free, which means you can download it now by going to leafacademy.org slash 28 days. Trust me, if you care about our schools and the future of education, you will download this free curriculum map right now or tell every teacher or principal you know to go to leafacademy.org slash 28 days and download this groundbreaking 21st century course right now. I want to thank you for watching this segment of the Tuesdays with Schwartz podcast. If you want to see the rest of the episode, you need to subscribe to my free newsletter. The link is in the description. If you're not a subscriber, thank you for joining me. And until next week, this is the School Doc saying, see you soon. <laughs>